if you guys want to get some coins to buy some actually good players and not the ones that I'm going to be picking in this foot draft, there's a link down in the description to the Ultimate Coin Exchange. AJ through will get you 5% off. You can pick up 100k for about £10 at my discount. They're 100% reliable and their link is down in the description. Hello and welcome back to the FIFA 16 foot draft today. As you can see by my jumper, I'm feeling pretty festive. I know it's only November, but what are you going to do? I've got the Christmas jumper on. However, it is going to be a case today of coal in the stocking because I'm going to be picking the lowest rated player every single time. Now, this is going to be a bit of a nightmare. I did the one where I just picked the highest rated player every single time. You guys seem to absolutely love it. You got like 9,000 likes or something like that. And you give me loads and loads of ideas. So people have suggested the slowest, the fastest, the lowest rated, which we're doing now. So if you enjoy it, let's see if we can smash 10,000 likes this time. And then next, I will do the highest rated one down in the comment section. So get voting and thumbing up over people's comments and comment on your own good ideas of highest rated or rather fastest, slowest. God knows what you guys can think of, and let's just get into this one and start picking the lowest rated player for a foot draft every single time. Why on earth am I doing this? We're just going to do it and see if I can actually win a game with it, even though it's not going to have any world class players in it. Unless it drops in like 390 rated, 5 it'd have to be 90 rated players in one go. We're, not, we're probably not going to get something amazing at all. We're just going to get a bang average team. But let's see if we can go the distance with a bang average team. I'm going to play 4-4-2 simply for the nice links. And we've got an 84 rated Danny Alves. We could have had him form Neymar. Could have had him form Royce. Could have had Ronaldo. Because we even have had Lewandowski. But no, we're going for Danny bloody Alves. Brilliant. What a captain he is. Okay, let's get him a link hopefully. Who have we got? 75 rated, this dude, a Serbi or Baruchki, as I assume I pronounce his name. So we're just going to go for a Serbi. Okay, it's not a bad start. Well, well, it is. It's as low as it could possibly be. So it is a bad start, but it could have been worse. Definitely could have been worse. Okay. Oh, 78 in the bleeding Camp Scottia Bank League. Is that the Paraguayan League? I don't even know. The Chilean League. We could have had Trap in form, form and in form. Bloody Peter Cech, who is sick. But no, we're going for this random dude in this random league. Okay, let's crack on. Centre-back, 82s. Better. We've got Manalas or Inkulu. Surely we have to go Manalas simply for that one first orange link. Oh my god. Let's grab our left back. Who are we going to get here? non -res. Woo! At least we get some choice because we've got 375s. We can have... French dude in the Hellas League, a Serbian dude in the Portuguese League, no, in the Turkish League, and then a Portuguese guy also in the Turkish League. It's not really much of a choice, is it, really? So we're just going to go for this Pinto dude, and let's see who we can get at left midfield. Kone! Yeah, we did! We got him from Aruna Kone. <laughs> okay, that is absolutely brilliant. There you go. Get in the squad, Aruna, you absolute god. Funny how when you're picking the lowest rate of players, you somehow get the best player on the whole bloody game. But that, that's just the way it goes sometimes. Let's grab ourselves a centre defensive mid. Oh, we almost got Teote for that strong link. It's a 79 rated, but he was pipped on the lowest by Condogbia, who doesn't link. Okay, he links to the Syria. He links to the Syria. Okay. Teote, please. Come on. Drop him in there again. 77 rated Casemiro or Jermaine Jones. It's got to be Casemiro, hasn't it? It's really, really not going well. Right midfield. Torre or Tosic. It's given us all right players, but we're having to pick all of the proper random ones in the proper random leagues. I suppose we go for this dude in the league earn rather than the guys in the Russian league or the Super League, but it really doesn't help us too much. We'll just go for the inform. Oh my God. Come on, just a link to someone. <laughs> Silvers. What am I doing? Oh, we should have went for Zardes. He would have got a strong link to Jones. We should have went to Jones because he would have got a strong link to Zardes. I can't even speak. I'm picking the worst players every single time. We've got two 72s. Both of them are in the MLS. We'll just go for Zardes. This this is not a good day to foot draft. This is not a good way to foot draft. Striker, last of our starting 11. 80, oh, I thought we had Aubameyang. I thought we had Aubameyang. At least we get a strong, well, we, at least we get A-Link. We get A-Link to Kone with the Ivorian inform Kalu. But it's not good. We've got 53 chemistry and only three links in the whole squad. Oh my God. Let's grab some people off this bench. 77 rated Holibas. 
I can deal with that. That brings in a better left back and it brings in one, two more links. That's brilliant. Greek to league to BPL. That is what I am talking about, Talibas. Doing the business, son. Okay. I'm, I'm enjoying that. That's good. That's good. Let's see if we can carry on that streak of getting some more links with an 81 rated Cerner or an 81 rated Evra. See, now Evra's out of position but gets the. It's our captain, Danny Alves. We could play him right mid, I suppose, and put Evra at right back, but he is out of position. But then this guy just doesn't get any links at all. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to bring in Evra. And we're going to switch them around. Look at that. We're up to 65 chemistry. Strong link and everything. This is going well. Well, it's not. It's going all right. It's considering how bad it could be. It's probably only a tiny little bit above that bad. 77 rated comes. As if EA were bantering me off enough. They dropped some cum in my squad. Great. Couldn't give us Ramirez, could it? Couldn't give us Nazri, even though we've already got one. A left mid in Kone, the best one in the game. It gives me cums. Thanks. Kovacic though, that's helpful. He gets another strong link, even though we have just jibbed off Kondogbia. We've got two strong links there. That is putting our first player onto full chemistry in Kaisamero. Oh my god. Okay, let's just crack on. Let's keep going. 81s across the board. We've got ourselves Depay or Coit. Obviously, we're not going to go for Coit. We're going to go for Depay because he's so much better. And then what do we do? I know exactly what we do. We bring in Depay here. We bring in Kone there. Is that, does that give us more chemistry? I'm pretty sure that's just give us more chemistry. We're up to 67. Kone's playing striker because that's where he was born to play. We've got Kalu there and we've got a link into the pie as well. Okay. 86s, 94s. Nope, we're going for the 79 rated for Hog. I don't even know what to say. This is such a bad idea. It's just teasing us with the Ronaldos. It's dropping the informs. It's giving us Felipe Mayo. Not even a little bit helpful. Ferreira Carrasco is pretty helpful though. That's actually not too bad. 280 rate. It's weird how we're getting so many informs in this squad, even though we're picking the lowest rated player every time. Because usually I go for Neymar or Pepe, but obviously we're getting these low rated informs and they're the ones that we're going to be going for. So if we do this, does that put my chemistry up? We're on 67 now. I'm not sure that did. 67 plays 67. I think I'd rather have Dani Alves and Ferreira Carrasco though. So that's what exactly we're going to do. Maybe we can get ourselves a low rated Liga BBVA centre back to play there. Or even a Serie A goalkeeper. Come on. Or Kadira. So unhelpful. But never mind. We'll go for Kadira like we said. The lowest rated one each time. Let's keep going. Who have we got this time? 77 rated at Turbe. Hmm. Jack Wilshire there. The highest rated player is the only non-rate. Never mind. We've got one more position. Can he give us someone good but low rated? Castan. That's actually helpful. That is actually very helpful. There we go. Look at all that chemistry. Plus 12 from dropping him into the squad. That is what I like to see. Okay. That's better. If we can give if we can get a Serie A goalie now. I've had no, I haven't. I was gonna say I've had worse teams. Have I hell. But Let's just do it. Let's just grab our final, final player. Who are we going to get? Lowest rated goalkeeper is from the Serie A. We've got 370. That's the Liga BBVA. Oh my God, he's just Italian. Not only, not only am I getting the terrible players, I can't even get their leagues right, but does he give me any more chemistry? He doesn't because none of them are Italian. Great. So there we have it then, that is what you get if you pick the lowest rated player every single time. We got an 84 Danny Alves for our captain, and then the highest rated player we got to take was an 83 Kadira from all of the other choices. Oh my god, that is arguably the worst foot draft I have ever seen in my life. And to be fair, I was trying to make it bad, or I wasn't trying to make it bad, I was trying to make it good, but with the situation that I put myself in, it was never going to be good. But... I thought it was going to be a little bit better than that. Like, I thought we'd have a couple where it'd be like Ronaldo, Messi, Neymar. Someone average and then someone reasonably decent that we could put in the squad. But the most reasonably decent player we got was Kadira. Let's just jump into a game and see if I can win it. What's the guy who comes up and against me going to think? Imagine it was someone first time playing the draft and they're thinking they're the type of squad you get. Kone and Kalu up front with a midfield of 77, 78, 80 and 81. Oh my god. Let's just get into a game and inevitably come up against Pierre Ball, Ronaldo and Messi. 
Yep, called it. Brilliant. His squad isn't actually as good as it could be, but he has got Inform, Muller, Inform, Royce. And he's actually not that amazing. His squad is 77 chem, 83 rated. My squad rating was 161. 161? Usually it's like 184 or something like that. That is ridiculous. 23 ratings lower. And I ended up with absolute madness. If we can win this game, it's going to be a miracle. I do need to remember we have got the Lord God Kony up front. So we could always do that. We have a miracle. An absolute miracle. But so far this has been the most boring 20 minutes of FIFA I've ever played. Come on. Oh my god, as if the only action of this whole entire game is in pinging a, cro a free kick top bin with Marco Royce. That informed Royce is absolutely sick to be fair, it's free kicks are incredible. As you have just witnessed, there's literally nothing I can do about that. Be my saviour here, Runa. Be my saviour. Be my saviour. Come on, you can do it. Stop, scoop, fake, shoot, goal, Kone. Yes, that is what I'm talking about. That is the wonder of Team Golden Head right there, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, we're in this game now. Let's do it. Oh, he's taking Kone out. He knows the wonder that is Aruna. Can Solomon do the same thing? He can. He's dancing. He's shooting. He scored. Oh, he's at the bar. Look at that. 93 kick accuracy from the pie. 38 yards out. Okay. Oh, God. Come on, Danny. You're the captain. Show your worth, mate. Yeah, oh, and I thought he had. Thought he showed his worth, and he's just been absolutely muggled off. Oh, my God. This guy is filth. Oh my god, as if I've just conceded that. Early cross and Thomas, informed Thomas Muller. But what? You don't expect to be conceding them from there. Go on, Kalu. Oh my god, cut one. No! That was almost from Cone Bay again. Time for an Andy special, boys. Let's pop this on Lord God Aruna's head. Oh, he ran away. And now we're going to get smashed on the counter-attack. I can feel it. Get it your foot in there. Get your foot in there. That's it. Get it down to Kone. Get it down to Kone. You just can't... You can't expect them to do everything, can you? No one else in this team's pulling their weight. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Yes, Danny Alves. Oh, my God. This is literally the only time we've got... Kone's passed him. No, he's not. Oh, that's the end of the game. That is the most boring game of FIFA I've ever played in my life. Both of our teams sucked. And there was literally three or four highlights in the whole bloody thing. So I apologise that it was massively lacking in gameplay. Don't go and build yourself a foot draft by picking the lowest rated player every time. That is absolutely ridiculous. They all suck apart from Kone. But yeah, that is going to be the end of this video. That free kick. Oh my god. It didn't go well for me. I hope you guys have enjoyed it anyway. Seeing me, how I got on, seeing the way a lowest rate of foot draft can go. It's, it's the worst idea I've ever done, to be perfectly honest. Well, it was a good idea because I hope you guys are entertained. But for me, I'm trying to get through the draft. It's an absolutely terrible idea. So if you have enjoyed it and you want to see more stupid stuff like this, make sure you smash a like. If we get to 10,000 this time, that would be insane. Remember to leave your ideas down in the comment section. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe if you are new. And I will see you next time.